<laughs> that, not too bad for the first take, huh? What's up, guys? It's uh, the morning. No, it's not. I'm sorry. It's noon. Finally, and we got the camera turned on. I've been doing lots of work this morning, lots of busy stuff. We're about to go get some crickets for the leopard geckos, our little brand new leopard geckos that if you saw yesterday, they were pretty cute. Oh, what's <laughs> oh, <geez. laughs> that morning. I can't yell so loud. We're blowing out the wow. microphone. I got jury summons too. That should be exciting. Maybe we can bring the camera into the courtroom. I highly doubt it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Whoa, he's yeah, still attached. Here's this summons. <laughs> Finally got yeah. this, this Freedom Breeder Rodent Transport Tub video done. You guys want to see a clip of that? Comment down below if you want to see a clip. Dude, you just hit me nuts, bro. Oh, you know what this tub also worked really well for last week when I went to do that ball python presentation at the Turtle Club? I put some snakes in those tubs. Those were great for transporting reptiles to the show too. So, yeah. I think it came out pretty good. I think I did a pretty decent job of making it happen and making it go nice. I'm gonna run away from these guys. We got rabbits, big rabbits thawing out. We're, we're feeding pets today, we're feeding pets. But we gotta go get some crickets. Let's go boys. I think what we'll also do since we got this all set up is we'll, we'll take out Roxanne the Tegu and see if she wants to sit on this table for a little bit and get some nice beauty shots of her. Mm, 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 mm. Cricket time. Go upstairs and feed the geckos and tortoises. I want to get Roxanne out and see if we can get her to sit on this table and get some nice beauty shots. <laughs> She's kissing my neck. Brandon, what a sweet animal this is, dude. Thank you again for bringing her here, dude. She's so cool. She's a big baby. She's getting dirt all over me. <laughs> all those nails. <laughs> oh, sorry. I'm not. She's like, you're not supporting me, dude. I'm gonna climb higher. Oh, I got you, baby. Don't worry. Oh my gosh, that is so freaking cool, man. Now we're chilling. Oh my gosh, look at that tongue. Man, you think snake tongues are cool, but then you see that thing come flicking out. I know, I'm not your daddy. Don't worry, you get used to me. Get used to putting those nails in my skin. <laughs> I got you, I got you. <laughs> look at all that dirt. <laughs> Ooh, my ice cream ain't doing me too bad. <laughs> Incredible animal to have the pleasure of being in the presence of. Wow, dude. Thanks for those great shots, Roxanne. Right, I'm, I'm gonna get her back in her little comfy zone and then clean my shirt off. We'll go upstairs and feed those uh, other animals. Uh, by, by the way, Roxanne won't be having her first meal with us until tomorrow. I haven't fed something cricket since I was like four years old, so. But my understanding is I gotta take this, uh, this calcium stuff that I just got and dust the crickets with it, put it in the bag and, and dust them up. Put it in the bag with the crickets, shake them up. Sorry, little crickets. You're getting all dusted with calcium. I guess you're about to die anyway, so. <laughs> Live death. It's the circle of life when you're dusting crickets. Seems inhumane. I guess it's gotta happen, man. Life. Death gives life. Death gives life. Death gives life. Those some dusted crickets. They dusted. Guys hicking over there. You guys hicking and hacking. What has mommy done to you? Oh, mommy was picking your nose for you? Yeah. Really? Yeah. That's ridiculous.
know. I know. Tegu lizards. What about tegu lizards? That they can get pretty big and I have one as a pet and is it a girl? It's a girl and it is a very large one. It's the largest one I've ever seen. Because it's the only one I've ever seen. <laughs> that is hilarious. But they have sharp claws. They get pretty big. And they're lizards and an arrow shaped head. And a big tail and four legs. And that's all I know. Oh, and they go slow. <laughs> go and slow. I'm Please. in the comfort of my home. I can have my butt hanging out. <laughs> hey, Eli. What? What do you know? I know. Geckos. What about geckos? That they have spots on them and a tail and good legs and a good teeth and they have great vision and they have and they eat crickets that's all i know hey mushy what do you know can you say gecko <laughs> you'll get it mush so we got names. We're keeping we're keeping Roxanne for the Tegu. We're keeping that name, even though we have a berm named Roxanne. We got the snake Roxanne and the Tegu Roxanne. And we got the tortoises, Stoli and Charlie. What? No, the, the tortoise's name is Stoli. Ooh. Charlie and Stoli. It even goes well together. What about Chuck? Chuck? I mean, Charlie yeah, you can Chuck. call Charlie, Charlie. Chuck is short for Charlie. <laughs> yeah, no, Charlie and something else. Stoli. Stoli. They are not even from Russia. It doesn't matter. They're Russian tortoises by name. So, even if they're just from. so cliche. Oh, Russian. Let's name it vodka. It's 100% original to name your Russian tortoise after a Russian drink. Go ahead and leave a comment down below. Are you Team Stoli or not Team Stoli? I'll think of another name and we'll get it. You know what? Frodo on, and throw that suggestion out. I'm still thinking. Throw it out. Leo. Charlie and Leo. <laughs> nope. <laughs> nope. You've named like every snake. Why can't I name the turtles? No, I've let you name snakes. I've let Noah name snakes. I've let my mom why, name snakes. Why are you so stuck on Stoli? It's not like you have some nostalgic thing with Stoli. I beg your pardon, Missy. You know that I'm a quarter Russian, right? Me and Stoli have had some good times. Oh, what about Hal? Don't bring your grandpa into this. Why? I know he's a great man I never got to meet, We've but don't snake after my grandma we could have a turtle after my grandpa I love you. and he's lithuanian i love you mom charlie and hal is she gonna believe it okay. team stoli that's nope that's my vote charlie and hal i disagree with her noah is team stoli are you team stoli Ooh, oh. <laughs> little mushy team stoli too team stoli team stoli team team stoli the leopard geckos the boy's name this morning we got Speckles and Scratch. Scratch is the female that I was helping feed. I wanted to make sure that she got food because Brandon said she needed to get uh, back up to wait because she just laid eggs. So I just wanted to make sure manually that she got some of those crickets and then we'll let, we'll let uh, Speckles, Speckles fend for himself. And Brandon got me all set up on, on how everything's set up and, and it, the way that he's been caring for him. I'm, I'm deferring to his experience because his experience is much greater than my own. He did mention that there may be people that will bitch and moan about how they're being kept and what he recommended to me is to tell those people to uh shut the front door I'm pretty sure that, that's like exactly what he said it was yeah shut the f front door that's what it was but but seriously i'm pretty inexperienced at keeping any of these animals so if you want to leave any comments down below and give me some pointers I'm all, I'm all ears. Well, I think that's good for us for the day. I gotta get to uh, work on Triple B TV, which is going up in a little bit here. No. So, uh, hey boys, you wanna say, oh. you wanna say bye? Bye, you're watching Triple B TV. <laughs> bye, you're watching Triple B TV. And I said, black old boom. She's, she's bigger than midnight, um, but she's good. And she'll kiss you.